What is going on outlaws? Once again, Michael or Legacy LegacyKillHD back with another Red Dead Redemption 2 video for you. It's been a long seven months since the reveal back in October of 2016. That's why today I thought we'd bring together a lot of the known Red Dead Redemption 2 details and quickly go through them. Now I need to make sure I state this, but not everything within this video is fact, as some details are simple speculation or theories, while others are pretty big leaks that have come before and after the reveal of Red Dead Redemption 2. But before we dive into all this information, if you haven't heard, I am doing a giveaway of Red Dead Redemption to. All you have to do is check the link in the description to enter, which also has a lot more information on this, and just be an active subscriber. Also make sure to check out some of my western or red dead themed shirt designs, like the wanted or legends never die design for the deadliest outlaws of the west, and currently if you use code legacy you'll be getting 10% off your purchase. But nonetheless I am going to be putting a counter up in the top left corner of all the details that we go over, but let's get started. First up we have is that leaked map that came in April of 2016, and other than it already being confirmed by a reputable inside source at Tech Radar, many of the locations on this map match the one seen in the first trailer. Now not everyone is crazy excited by this as it is much smaller than Grand Theft Auto V's map, although it is bigger than Red Dead Redemption's, and it does show various regions and many locations that have hidden Native American meanings such as Kahuta, which means mountains that hold the sky in many Native American languages. Remember this image that was leaked from a Rockstar employee's portfolio? Well, it's more than likely an early alpha image of Red Dead Redemption 2, as it features some of the same things seen in the first trailer like an old lamp and possible first protagonist. This concept art that is on the screen right now is coming from an ex-Rockstar employee maybe of Red Dead Redemption 2, which shows off potential customization and outfits of Native American and cowboy characters. Within the first trailer and map, it is clear that Rockstar will be tackling Native Americans much more in Red Dead Redemption 2, which could result in a lot of different weaponry and culture. A key feature missing in Red Dead Redemption was dual wielding, but based on the cover and first trailer of Red Dead Redemption 2, that will be in the next western adventure. Many are worried if Rockstar will release Red Dead Redemption 2 on time, but take 2 CEO Strauss Elnick, and if you didn't know, Take-Two is the parent company of Rockstar Games, gave these comments on if Rockstar would land the release date of fall of 2017 for Red Dead Redemption 2. No, you don't like to promise without being, you're the least promotional CEO, but also the CEO's probably done the best since we've been interviewing each other. You can't promise necessarily when something will come out, but this could be big for next year. Well, we've said fall of 2017. Right. But, how, but how do you know that when you've told me over and over again, if it's not perfect, you're not, take, you're not gonna let it come out? Uh, there's no question that perfection is the standard that the team at Rockstar Games is seeking. It's right. certainly the standard that I'm seeking. And I am highly confident that we're gonna be out in fall of 2017 uh, with Red Dead Redemption 2 and with an online component. So it's very, very exciting. Zelnick also promised that Red Dead Redemption 2 will have an incredible emotional depth and he thinks that the times are right for a big, sprawling, optimistic view of America again, and that's not meant to be cute. Take-Two believes that Grand Theft Auto Online and Red Dead Online will not compete and can coexist together. Also, it seems that a ton of gaming retailers these last couple of months have claimed the release date of Red Dead Redemption 2. A few examples are UK's base claiming a September 26th release, and Poland's media market claiming October 3rd, all later being retracted, so for now, all these dates are probably just speculation. It's being said based on the LinkedIn profile of a Rockstar employee that development on Red Dead Redemption 2 began as far back as 2012. Also, it was discovered a connection of voice actors that will be a part of Red Dead Redemption 2, with Benjamin Byron Davis returning as Dutch Vanderlyn, Steve Jay Palmer as Bill Williamson, and Rob Weedoff as John Marston, along with the new additions of Noshir Dalal, Callie Moore, Peter Blumquist, Gabriel Slaughter Cerrone, and Roger Clark. Also coincidentally, when news broke of Roger Clark possibly being one of the new main characters of Red Dead Redemption 2, he liked my own video discussing his involvement in the game, which I think he didn't know his likes were public. Next is a bombshell leak from a Rockstar employee who previously leaked Grand Theft Auto Online DLC word for word, in which he confirmed we would play as three protagonists in Red Dead Redemption 2, but John Marston would not be one of them. He also mentioned many activities in Red Dead Redemption will return like gang hideouts and side missions, but that Red Dead Online will not launch day one, as Rockstar will need to prepare the servers like how Grand Theft Auto Online started years ago. He also later confirmed that Rockstar will have a PC version of Red Dead Redemption 2 at a later date. A recent article done by Windows Central claims that they have inside knowledge that Red Dead Redemption 2 and a bunch of other third-party games will utilize and showcase the true potential of Project Scorpio, 
meaning that Rockstar will probably be supporting this advanced Xbox One. Sony and Rockstar also have a partnership for Red Dead Redemption 2, as PlayStation 4 players will receive online content first. The Last of Us and The Last of Us Part 2 composer and two-time Oscar winner Gustavo, can't say his last name, is rumored to be involved with Red Dead Redemption 2, as one of his original songs appears to have been remade for the first trailer of Red Dead Redemption 2. Longtime Rockstar North President Leslie Benzies is no longer with Rockstar Games. He's also actually suing the company, but it's important because he was a key reason Red Dead Redemption was able to release in May of 2010. This will be the first game without Leslie being with the company since around the year 2000. It's said that Rockstar North is mainly helping with the online site of Red Dead Redemption 2 as Rockstar San Diego is the main developer on this. Pre-orders have been unavailable on Amazon for the PlayStation 4 version of Red Dead Redemption 2 as the retail giant has reached its current limit. It's being said that this upcoming western is a prequel somehow involving an early Dutch's gang. Rockstar has been improving their game engine, which is called the Rage Engine, and it's rumored that we could be seeing a working ecosystem in RDR2, meaning we'll see animal and animal interactions. We may actually be able to see things like a vulture flying from above and grabbing its prey, and other things along those lines. But based on the image of a character rowing a small canoe, we can assume swimming and boat travel will be a part of Red Dead Redemption 2. The seven outlaws seen in the game cover and trailer have been compared to the 1960 movie The Magnificent Seven. Briefly through the first trailer, we can see different scenes under various conditions conditions of weather, which could be hinting to dynamic weather. Lastly, this will be Rockstar Games' first title made specifically for the current consoles of the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Anyway gang, that's a very fast roundup of a lot of the things that we know so far about this upcoming western adventure from Rockstar Games, but let me know which detail strikes you as the most interesting or compelling. Anyway, thank you for watching, make sure to consider smacking that like button if you did enjoy this video or found any informative value, also consider subscribing to stay up to date on everything Red Dead Redemption 2 related, and remember, Outlaws to the end.